Guys, I'm gonna do a video real quick. I got a case of this Leaf Best of Basketball. Uh, this is my first time trying to do a video with my laptop, so uh, if there's any technical difficulties, I apologize. Uh, so what we're gonna do here is we're gonna bust a three box case of Leaf Best of Basketball. A um, little bit concerned with this product based on what I've seen from uh, some of the other videos, but I already bought the case. I won a thousand dollars with a uh, with the NCAA bracket, so we'll see how it goes. I think a lot of people have been disappointed with this product, mainly because there's not a ton of big hits. I mean, there's some. The thing is, there's very, very big hits, and so in order to make money, they obviously had to put some lower price stuff in here as well, which has been the big issue. Um, nobody really likes to see it in a $300 product, but if you want $10,000, $15,000 hits, you got to take what you get. So anyway, we will get at it. I've also never used this knife on a break before. So. Here we go, let's hope for the best. Now I'll just pull it off one at a time. First card we got here is a Bailey Howell Green, number 20 out of 25. Not familiar with him, but I'm not a huge basketball guy, so I'm maybe missing something. And then I have not looked at this yet, but. We'll reveal it. We got a 1999-2000 Topps Autographs Tim Duncan. I gotta get go backwards. So uh, eight autograph, not the best grade, but at least it's an on card car, an on card autograph, and not one of those aftermarket Topps Chrome Kevin Durant or. Derek Rose autographs that are graded authentic, so that's a step in the right direction anyway. That's the first box. Obviously everybody's going for the really big hits in this product. Um, the Michael Jordan 1998 autograph, the LeBron Rose Durant exquisites. Uh, those are definitely some big hits, so I'd love to get one of those, but you know, also very, very rare. So we do have a 9.5, which is a good thing. So uh, next one, we got a Cliff Hagen autograph, not serial numbered. And then next we have a LeBron James 2011-2012 SP Authentic autographs. Uh, this is a sticker autograph, but I think this is actually an autograph. So this is BGS 9.5, which is always nice when you actually get a gem man out of this product. I've seen a lot of bad grades so uh, with a 10 autograph. So that one's a pretty nice card. I mean, I don't think it's a high dollar one, but you know, it's a nice product. You can't really complain. I mean, you're paying $300, and you're pretty much every case I've seen is getting uh, at least two Hall of Famers. Surefire Hall of Famers and then future Hall of Famers potentially. So, box three. We need the the big one now. Would love a Durant, but not one of the other ones. So this is not a too bad of a. Card. We got a Dennis Rodman green number 19 out of 25. So not too bad if you're going to get the leaf ones. You might as well get a good player with the short printed version. So not too bad. And not really thinking this one's going to be that great, but uh, I could be wrong. I don't know. This is a 1996-97 finest Kobe Bryant. I believe this is his, this is his rookie year actually. Uh, graded a BGS 9.5. Not sure what that's worth. Uh, 9.5. One of Kobe's rookie cards is 
you could definitely do worse. I've seen a lot worse come out of this product. So no huge hits, but not a terrible case either. I've seen many, many worse. So hope you enjoyed it, and good luck to whoever's going to get the big hits.